so season three. Season three. Yep. Got off to a wild start. <laughs> yes, um, it is. <laughs> yes, so what and has this been... One. <laughs> <laughs> what has been sort of the fan reaction to the first episode? I think um, I think people are really happy to see me moving on yeah. and with someone who treats me a lot better than the last guy did. I think Madison has a big bomb to drop as well with she's dating our old producer, as we now know. <laughs> mm -hmm. So that was... Yeah. People are, it's like mixed feelings, it's, I right? I feel like on, on, in both cases, I think um, because first of all, because Robbie came in as a bachelorette alum, um, so people either liked him or didn't like him, and I think that's how we kind of felt right. um, as Juliet's friends. We already we didn't know him personally, but we obviously had preconceived notions about mm -hmm, him. Mm -hmm. So, and I think the fans kind of reacted the same way. You know, they're happy for Juliet that she's moving on. Some are like super Team Robbie. Some are like very skeptical. Yeah, you guys kind of have an interesting story. You met at Stagecoach, mm -hmm. and then sort of had like a couple months of bliss, a month or two of bliss, yeah. and started this show. What? Honeymoon period. Honeymoon period. It was like, yeah, it was all happiness until we kind of, uh, weirdly enough, got back into reality. Yeah. But, um, yeah, and then I guess everything kind of caught up to us. But we're here now, and we're still friends. It, was a fun it still time. works. Is that There's genuine? Ups and downs, like, how and you weird get to see it unfold. It's not that weird. <laughs> I've been I've been through way weirder. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this is not that bad. Thinking, yeah. It's yeah. Actually, yeah, you guys are probably like pros at this. Yeah. Not bad. Wow. We're yeah. really good at the awkward. They keep it professional, which yeah. is. I mean, just We're from being a third wheel today. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> they've kept it really, really simple. I mean, this is better than us being like all over each other like we were in the beginning of summer. <laughs> this is true. All this of our friends true. are like, please Pick stop Pick your touching. poison. Yeah. I guess I'd rather third wheel with them not as a couple <laughs> than as a couple. That is very fair. That's a good fair. point. We see the breakup on the show. Mm -hmm. um, but, you know, I have to say that fans who have watched recent interviews are getting the vibe that you potentially ended things mm -hmm. and that you are potentially still salty about things? Is there any truth to this assumption? I, think I am no, I'm not salty. No, okay. I mean, probably not salty anymore. <laughs> anymore. She likes to let it be known that I might have been salty. You were salty. I was salty <laughs> because you dealt with it wrong. But that's I dealt what you'll with see what? unfold. You dealt with it wrong. You responded to a fan. There was a mature relationship with an immature breakup. That's it. Ugh. Okay, that's fair. Ish. Next question. <laughs> okay. Is there any chance you guys would get back together? I, I I don't know. As of right now, no. But keep the fans on their toes. <laughs> There's just, Wait, I just don't new, know. I can't predict the future. This is a new response from what you've been saying all day. <laughs> so earlier no, you said really. no, but I'm, I, I mean no right now. But like I don't know. I I surprised myself. Like who knows where I'm gonna be in a year? I didn't think I would be right here a year ago today. So I'm honestly not gonna like take anything off the table anymore. Yeah. You could see me sailing off with Leonardo DiCaprio next she does year. All right, she putting it out there. Punches. Honestly, you know, I like that. I yeah. like that. Put it out into the universe. Yeah. Robbie, what about you? Could you see yourself um, getting back together? Yeah, I mean I. I roll with the punches and I did have a great time with the two months that we we spent together so I, I mean it okay. happened it mm -hmm. happened so I'm hearing that there's a possibility for a future <laughs> maybe and there's a chance yes <laughs> is that dumb oh, and dumb exactly you're gonna take that and exactly. run with it no. <laughs> Juliet your ex Alex uh, was clearly bothered by your new relationship mm -hmm. um, did you ever like fear that he was going to do something yeah, that's why I would never bring Robbie and Alex around each other. Really? Like, I made it, like, something, yeah. I would actively try to not have them in the same setting. Um, we did, at one point, have them around each other, and it went the exact way that I thought it would. Mm. Maybe not to the point that I thought it would, but exactly. I also waited a really long time, and I also didn't know that he was coming to that event. Yeah, I mean, it's hard when you're on the same reality show yeah. with a small group of people. Like, right. they're bound to... See but I, I basically kept them apart for a long time because I, I know Alex <laughs> and I know that he's going to try to throw hands, which is also like, and I was doing both of them a favor because, well, you know what I mean. <laughs> I think I sat out of most events so that you could have fun. You didn't tell me not to go to many events. Yes, I did. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Didn't I? Okay. <laughs> I also wanted to ask you, Juliet. So, mm -hmm. um, Alex and his new girlfriend, Alyssa, mm -hmm. are having a baby. <gasps> no. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> and I have to ask, because you wrote it on Instagram and yeah. then deleted the comment um, that you claimed you two had sex while she was pregnant. That's not true. Not while she was pregnant. It was before... It was... 
re re what really happened was they conceived like the exact week <laughs> that she found out <laughs> that he had cheated on her with me. That's what happened. So it was before. Um, and they had only been dating for a couple months at that point. And so you're saying she found out while she was pregnant, but it didn't happen while she was pregnant. No, no, no. They conceived right when she found out. The timeline is a little unclear. Blurry. At this point. Okay. Yeah. I mean, Amanda I see, and Chloe did the math, so that's the story. I we could all do the math, really, if we right. wanted. We don't but. know the exact time of. Well, when she found, we do really. Do we? No. we really do. Yeah. I mean, you don't have I don't to know reveal. If that's a secret. <laughs> we do. But. Okay. Um, do you regret writing that on Instagram? Yeah, I do. But it's not like. It's not like I'm making up like lies. Right. So okay. I was obviously that really, like really was like a huge slap in the face to me because we had broken up the same year. He knocked up another girl. So I was like, that's like not that he meant to, which I he didn't mean to. Mm -hmm. But it was also like kind of like a slap in the face. So I, I um do regret it. But you guys are gonna find out anyway. Well, did either of them reach out to you in regard to that comment? No. So we just I would I asked my friends if I should apologize and they said there's no point. <laughs> so it didn't. Okay. Yeah. All right. Fair enough. I um, mean, like I said, it's gonna get to them one way or another. So Yeah. Band aid is ripped off now and Do you think he'll be faithful to her moving forward? Uh yeah, I do. Okay. <laughs> so Madison, yes. you just went public with your boyfriend who used to be a show producer. Yes. How did that come about for you? So after season two ended, um, I came out to LA to pursue acting, to take some classes. And while I was here, I got in con back in contact with our old producer, Ish, and um, I pursued him. Oh. And yeah, things just, we started dating, we fell in love, and mm -hmm. I said, hey, like, this is my life, I'm filming, will you come just let's do this. Like, I want you to be a part of my life, so this is my life. Who are you most nervous to tell about this relationship? Because I know there's an age gap. You know, he was technically production on your show. I mean, there's a yeah, lot that goes into for it. For sure. Um, my parents. Oh. Absolutely. How do they take it? Um, not great. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. That's OK. It's OK. I knew it was going to be a hard conversation. Um, and, you know, they're coming around. Yeah.